All right, so here is a beautiful example. Uh, we're talking mint condition, folks. This is the Heathkit Mutual Conductance Tube Tester Model TT-1 or uh, TT-1A. Uh, it's um, gorgeous. I've had this for a while. I have uh, too many tube testers, and I'm not using it. So uh, I thought, you know, I'm going to check this out. I got it well, a couple of years ago, so it's been sitting on the shelf. And, you know, just it was so pretty, I didn't want to mess with it. <laughs> but I did go ahead. Let's see if I can get in here without causing a shadow. This darn lighting in my room here isn't the best. There we go. Uh, I mean, uh, just look how, how clean the uh, panel is there. And I, uh, I presently have a uh, Mullard uh, 12AU7 in the tester. So they had a little sticker of, sticker of some sort, like a little, uh, I don't know what it was, right there. Uh, that's, I think that's just glue that will be removed. But uh, anyway, the uh, the roll chart works nicely. And um, I went all the way up and down with it. Uh, let's see. Um, controls. Just I'll just go slow so you can see how nice this is. Um, I brought it up slowly using my Variac just because it's been sitting a while. But, um, you know, it has all the... If you are used to these type of tube testers, then you'll have a little more understanding of how to use one it's not super difficult the instructions are very clear and let me and speaking of instructions let's see here it has the uh, operational manual here let's set these all out it has the assembly manual which is very nice also these are in just excellent condition and there's the uh, tt1a um, assembly manual also with uh, some extra supplements there's the connecting cables for this um, and the lid um, adapter so that's all that stuff um, and I've already set the line voltage uh, to do that you simply um, make sure you're in a good you know 110 circuit and then press that down so I'll show you that there you have it and it's adjustable uh, by this uh, uh, set line right there so real simple to use uh, once you set up all the uh, positions according to the chart and then when you do your test you you uh, use the GM switch which is right here and by depressing that that will give you the test and on the chart it will show you uh, like this particular one the 12AU7 needs to read at uh, 710 or better and so get this thing back up on the meter here we can see it there we go and so as I depress this you'll see let me get in on there and this one is definitely a good tube it's well above a thousand and so on that side of the tube checks good uh, to check the other side you uh, use the the uh, G1 P1 K1 switches uh, according to the uh, chart there so that's how it works um, that's how nice this thing looks let me go ahead and power this off real quick um, oh I won't show you in the video how nice the outer case is uh, but this is uh, an eBay ad item so if uh, this is still around <laughs> when you see this video, you'll see it on there. But um, if you're looking for one uh, just to look at and say, hey, I've got a pretty one, here it is. And it appears to be working fine. I've tested a couple tubes, uh, but that's all I'm going to do. And, uh, I mean, this thing is just in excellent condition. The Heathkit Mutual Conductance Tube Tester Model TT-1.